town below is Barnwell, South Carolina, the home of one of the most influential men ever to affect the course of events of this state. His name, Solomon Blott. Saul Blott is the Speaker of the House in South Carolina, but on examination he is much, much more. He moves about in his town talking, shaking hands, joking, but at the same time listening. Listening so that he will be aware of the needs of his people when he represents them in the South Carolina State House. We must do something locally. Saul Blott believes in the local people helping themselves financial independence and firm control of taxpayers' dollars. Put the money where it's needed most. You know, I've been a very fortunate fellow. I, I came up the hard way. My daddy, as you know, as I've uh, explained to you, could not speak English for a long time. And uh, we had it tough. But I had the finest father and mother that any son ever had. And uh, uh, my home life was good there because my mother and father tried to teach me uh, to do that which was right, uh, to accept that which came to me to be thankful for the good things of life and not always look upon the dark side of the picture. Many plausible characteristics were obvious early in Saul Blatt's life, but leadership, his ability to motivate others by words and deeds, was the most prevalent. From 1917 to 1934, all was not smooth sailing. Like many other Americans, Saul Blatt served with the United States Army in France during World War I. He quickly rose to the rank of sergeant and was discharged from service in 1919 after the armistice was declared. Saul Blatt continued his law practice and in 1930 he made an unsuccessful bid for a seat in the House of Representatives. It was not until 1933 that he was to become a member of the state legislature. In January 1937, Saul Blatt was elected Speaker of the House. He has held that position ever since. The Speaker of the House of Representatives is the most powerful official in our state government. It's a great power. It could be in the hands of uh, an evil man of some harm. But certainly we have demonstrated uh, during your administration that it can be the strongest support of conservative government. And as long as uh, the uh, people of this state uh, respect and appreciate high character and great capacity and great courage, they will remember your service to South Carolina.